Amsterdam here, and I'm at the Circus Festival in Salzburg. And here is my good friend, Philip. And he is going to show you a couple cool tricks with my new takeaway foldable flower stick. Oh yeah! Let's go. Okay, here we go. This is the new Ultimate Flower Stick Set. Simply take it out, put it together, and the party can begin. First, get a bit of a feel for the flower stick. Throw it up with one spin in both directions. And throw it really high and catch it again. And now, the first trick, the tick-tock. It is the basic movement with a flower stick. Note, the place to hit the flower stick when doing the tick-tock is a bit above the middle of the flower stick, the tick-tock. Then you can slowly lift it up. So you start with a tick-tock on the ground and then lift it up slowly. Okay. When you do the tick-tock, you could start working with the first trick like one spin or two spins. And the same thing with the other hand. And now we are going to learn the tock tock. It is important to let the stick over spin a bit. With the tock tock, we can do very fast movements. With this movement, we can also throw up the flower stick and spin it quickly. And now, a few tricks. The first trick is the bell spin. This is the bell, and this is the stick. So the arm is rigid, and the movement is short. To begin, we let the flower stick spin around the stick once. And after that, short, stiff movements. Now we will learn using only one hand. The flower stick spins around halfway. It looks like a whole spin, but it actually is only a half spin. You throw it up here, let it spin once, and catch it on the other side. The catch. Can you show me one more time? Nice. All right, and now a couple really cool tricks for professionals. This one is called the saw. This one is called the helicopter. Infinity. Plus a multiplex and a back cross and finally the fishtail. Hey Philip, thanks for all your tips and I can't wait to see how many people are going to be learning the flower sticks. Yeah, Mr. M, Mr. Philip. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Okay, and now we're going to learn how to play without, yes, without the sticks, with my good friend Nico. 
and he's going to show us how to play a different way. What can you show us without using the sticks? Okay, I can show you all the basic moves like this one, but normally we don't use the stick because I, I love uh, learn the contact like this. You can imagine your, all your arm is your stick finally, and after you can try to make a lot of things like this but if you start so what's the first start what do we have to do the first start you put your arm like this you don't move and after with your finger you try to come here and come here like this for after put the arm and you always hold it uh, what part goes over the arm the middle the end the end the end goes over the arm the flower, so not the middle time. oops My hand. Okay. For us, I'll try if you take the, the, the stick there. If you balance. If you can make one, you can make two, you can make three. Like this. And if you want to try, you can make a big combo. One, two, three. So many possibilities. Nice. So, one, two, and three. Yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> That's great. Ah. And this is my specialty. But I like your stick because I can do that. <laughs> Nico, thank you very much for the trips. Thank you. All right. And hope you can enjoy. See you soon. Over the arm, the leg, over the leg, the and the neck. Ah, the neck. Many tricks can also be done with two sticks. For example, playing with one hand or the bell spin. Both of these tricks can even be done with two sticks. Transitioning to the propeller. One of the most difficult tricks is the double tick-tock. And now, scaring the cameraman.